welcome to the finale of Destroy All Humans 2 on the Friendship Express. So, uh, yeah, the, we decided since we're just fucking around anyway, that, I mean, we don't want to, like, waste your guys' time and, like, Yeah, we're not gonna... You, oh, we didn't want to let you down thinking, like, we were actually gonna, like, do the whole game. Yeah. But... We might do the original one eventually, just because I actually do, like, really enjoy the story and everything for that one. But this one, I just don't have the fucking patience for it right now. Yeah. I just, I need, after... It's kind of like, it's kind of like GTA for me, or, like, like most open yeah. world games for me, it's just like, like, you'll get tempted to do the story, and then you'll just fuck around, like, way more than you yeah. did actually any story. <laughs> so, so like, yeah, and it's just like, after I am I work for, like, six or seven hours a day, and then I come home... It's just like, I fucking don't want to do this. <sighs> well, this is a this is a cool change of scenery. Like yeah, it, it is. is. Yeah, it is. It's uh, very British. It is very British, especially all the fucking fog. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, quick, 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 quick. Uh, name... Name what? Your favorite British film. Oh, fuck. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Full Monty? All of them? No, not Monty Python. Full oh. Monty. Something completely different. What the fuck is Full Monty? Oh my god. I, I vaguely remember it because I watched it as a little kid. I mean, it's not a movie you should have watched as a little kid. Oh, well, yeah, that doesn't fucking it's, surprise me. It's about, um, I think it's it's like mostly about these male strippers. Oh. <laughs> but it's like a comedy movie and it's, it, they're, they're, I think the joke is like, I mean, it's, they're male strippers, but they're like, <laughs> like average attractiveness yeah, like uh, one of them is like fat and yeah. or something i i forget like the whole premise of the movie but i remember laughing a lot at that at that movie when i was a little kid I there's imagine. A, there's a little there's a scene where um this guy's trying to have like a serious conversation with someone and then out of the window one of his friends is like playing with gnomes <laughs> what and, and he like smashes the gnomes together <laughs> it's that 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 scene used to have me in tears. Well, damn. I'll have to watch it. What what's yours? What's your favorite? Uh, movie? Three Flavors Cornetta trilogy. Never heard of it. You've you've seen them. Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz. Oh, and, Shaun of the Dead is pretty the fucking end. great. Yeah. I think I think Full Monty just for me like the nostalgia factor. Yeah. But it's still pretty great. I, I I'm really pretty sure I would still. Have you seen Hot Fuzz? So. No, I've only oh seen God. Hot Fuzz is fucking brilliant. That's I've only seen Shaun of the Dead. Movie. I saw it at like three o'clock in the morning on Adult Swim. Oh yeah. <laughs> so that was that was my experience with it. It's such a good movie. I love and it. I, and I usually hate zombie movies, mm -hmm. and that that's like the only zombie movie I like. Oh really? I, I I'm not into the whole zombie genre. I just I'm never not got that into big it into it either. Something. But there are a lot of there there are plenty of like good zombie movies that I've enjoyed. Like what? The original Night of the Living Dead, and uh, 21 Days Later, and hmm. uh, uh, that's probably it. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. Um, I'm trying to think of some other good British movies. You could just start hollering them out. Uh, uh, say if I've seen them or whatever. Uh, any of the Mr. Bean movies? Oh, <laughs> dude, I used to watch the show all the time. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Because um, I used, I used to live in Italy. <laughs> oh yeah, just a fun fact for everyone. That. And David lived in Italy. I, I don't know if so like we got. Means. I don't know if we got like the VHS for okay, it. Okay, we just, or... we're just running in circles. It's like just throwing the same fucking people. Let's go do. Let's go somewhere else. Let's go find something to do. Yeah. Albion's kind Whoa. of a big place. It's kind of glitched out on me right now. Oh, kill him. Yeah, uh, we promise the next game we play will not be like this. Yeah. We just, this is just, I don't know, we needed to unwind a bit. It's yeah. been a very busy week. Yes, it's been ridiculous. I've been, I've been recording music and writing essays. And, and I work and uh, help, and I watch Woog edit the show just to make sure he does it right. Yeah. Even though I have no idea what he's doing. I don't doing really do any, uh, with anything with the with the editing. but uh, Yeah, it's all Woog. It's all Woog and... Tyler uh, supervises it. Yeah, I'm a supervisor. I have to be here or else nothing can get done because we've just fucking 
smashes his claws into the. Yeah, that's exactly it. He just like, or he's just like, and he's like, "This is about right," and you're like, "Whoa, stop it!" <laughs> this is like 420 blazing with Camellia salamanders. <laughs> he's like, he has Jesus riding on him. Oh yeah, <laughs> as, he's, as he's killing. <laughs> Every... Black Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, you know, uh, there's gonna be a Black Jesus movie. Are you serious? Yeah, the guy who, uh... That's a little bit too far, but no, I... No, no, Aaron Magruder, the guy who does the Boondock, is making it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that yeah. Black Jesus. Yeah, okay. I remember there was a Black Jesus on Family Guy, too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I think it's gonna be a movie. It's either a movie it's... or it's gonna be a new show on this one. I keep I... on forgetting. I really hope it's not one of those, uh... Remember, uh, like sometimes they take uh, they take uh, Saturday Night Live skits like way too far, and they make them into a movie. Oh yeah, like uh, McGruber. Have you? Do you know what that's all yes, about? Yes, I know. And, I know about McGruber. I saw that movie. And didn't didn't Will Forte play as McGruber? Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. It was actually pretty funny, but like it's like the dumbest type of humor. Yeah, and like if you don't like like the stupidest kind of humor, you're not gonna like that. And movie. I remember at the time, cause my brother and I, I was watching wrestling with my brother a lot at the time, because they had like a shitload of wrestlers just randomly cameo in the movie. Yeah. Like I remember, the only ones I remember off the top of my head is I know Chris Jericho was in it, maybe The Big Show, and I think Kane, I can't remember. I'll have to, I'll have to search the interwebs later. I, that. I, kind of like completely forget the movie the only thing that sticks out to me was um the the intro for it they had like a choir scene like the mcgruber theme uh-huh and then at the very last line of the theme goes we made a fucking movie mcgruber <laughs> <laughs> that's great yeah and it, that's like at the very beginning that's <laughs> hilarious oh man oh, oh man oh boy oh yeah uh, have you ever played the Bloody Roar games? Never heard of them. Oh, shit, man. That's their, uh, their fighting game on... I remember playing one on the original PlayStation. I think it was Bloody Roar 2. And there's another one. But we should play them, because it's... I don't want to explain anything to you. I just want you to see it. Oh, just, like, experience it. You're not going to yeah. give away anything? It's very Mortal Kombat-esque. It's Esque. very, very like so that. It's, so it's a fighting game? Yes. All right. You would, I think you'll dig it, especially like once I get the cheat codes and we have big heads going and everything. Yeah. There's, there's one of them that's like, it's much more cartoony than the rest. I think that's the one we probably end up playing. I can't yeah. think of what it's called off the top of my head. I have a question for you. Though. Yes. What is your favorite Mortal Kombat game? Uh. I know mine. Mine would be a tie between Deadly Alliance, just for nostalgia reasons, and probably two. Mortal Kombat 2. Mine's Deadly Alliance. Oh, really? Yeah. Dude, let's play Deadly Alliance on the show, <laughs> I'm down for that. I used to have it, and then I someone stole it. I have it. I have it. I think it's out in my tub. You have you have it in your tub? Yeah. <laughs> it's out in the tub. The tub. Yep, it's in the tub. tub. It's bathing right now. <laughs> we're getting some. We're getting uh, it all sudsy. If I do have it, it's on GameCube, though. Hopefully it's okay with you. That's fine. I mean, it's... Cool beans. I mean, it's not like GameCube has one of the most awkward controllers I've ever experienced. And if I don't but... have it, uh, we'll buy it because that game is fucking awesome. Yeah, I've played it hundreds and hundreds. Of the hours. Uh, the like the unlockables in the crypt. Oh my god! Ten out of ten. <laughs> Cooking, Cooking with, with scorpion. scorpion. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Brains me back. Learn chopping. 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 <laughs> Cake decorating and chopping. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, meat tenderizing is one of them too. Chopping. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. So great. I, anyone I've ever like sat there and played Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance with, I was just like, okay, we have to unlock this thing. Like, I just want new characters. <laughs> Why do we have to get this? And then I showed it to him like, dude, it was worth it. Yeah. Like, for the seven hours of playing through just to fucking get it. The I think I I played. That Deadly Alliance so much that I fucking unlocked everything in the game. Me too. Pretty sure. I don't. I don't know if I have that memory card anymore. Though. I should have. That is very sad. Right now. That'll make me cray. Cree. Cree. That'll make me cray every team. Cree every team. So uh, you know what? Hmm. This is a lot of fun. Yeah, it I is like a lot of fun. I army trucks, and it's really helping me online. It's, it's probably not this. fun visually for the audience, but no, it's. it's not. <laughs> 
Hopefully, let's listen to our voices saying things and making sentences. It's not fun for them. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, that that's the entertaining part here because yeah, that's otherwise, they're like, what the fuck is. <laughs> they're just running around doing. Su- oh, God, that burp smells. Mine? Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh. Is it that bad? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh God! I've never, I've never smelled a burp that smelled that bad. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Saucy pig. <laughs> oh, it's not that bad. Okay, you fucking drama queen, cut it out. No, no, that was terrible. Stop it. <laughs> That's gross. Why are you smelling your own burp? Because I can't are you proud smell of it. it? <laughs> I'm kind of am, yeah. <laughs> oh, that was rank. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see how it could be that bad. It was ever. bad. No, it wasn't. You're fucking lying. I'm telling you, I've never smelled a... Br- that was, like, worse than a fart. <laughs> Jesus. You just farted out of your mouth. That's basically what you did. <laughs> I'm gonna vomit out of my asshole.